All right, and welcome to the seventh video in this series. And now we're going to be talking about merging. So you can find that merge action under the Edit Mesh menu. Um, we've already talked about Extrude. We've already talked about inserting our own edges with the Insert Edge Loop tool. Now if you go down to Merge, and I'm actually going to go to Options, we can see here this is pretty much the only option we have for this thing. Um, we only have two. Well, um, I have Always Merge Two Vertices checked. So if I accidentally have three vertices selected, it's only going to merge two of them. Um, <clears throat> how does it decide which two? Well, this is the threshold. This is basically the distance around each particular selected vertices that is going to go out to search for what to connect to. So if you have a vertice here and say a vertice that's very, very far away, um, chances are it probably may not connect even though you, you select them both and do merge um, because it may be out of the threshold. So you can just come to the options here and increase the threshold um, or if you have always merge two vertices like I do it will just kind of disregard it. So if I go ahead and select this one and this one and because I have this checked I do apply it's actually going to merge together. Now I'm going to undo that and say I uncheck this. Let's see if it works. Look at here, it doesn't. All right, so because my threshold isn't big enough, and I didn't actually have this checked, even though it popped up here in my history, my merge vertice one, I can do this again, and see merge vertice two is popping up over here in my history, but it's not moving because you know it's it's out of the threshold. So I'm actually going to undo both of those, turn them checked back on and close this out. Alright, now you can merge vertices together like I've just done. Um, let's see here. Gonna go back and make sure that's checked. Okay. Alright, so I have these merged. Now say I want I'm gonna undo that. Say I want all these to be merged together, but I want them to be merged right in the center. Um, right underneath merge you have the option merge the center so that's actually you don't have any options for that because that's literally exactly how it is um, whatever you have selected it doesn't matter how much vertices you have once you select it it's going to determine the center of all those vertices and it's just going to merge them all into one point and this doesn't give regard to anything um, the amount or the distance at all it's just going to merge them all to the center of everything you have selected Alright, so real quickly, that's just some real quick ways to merge vertices together. Um, next, we'll look into something that's called beveling, which is how you can round off your edges.